Hello Ziz. so today we're doing an eyebrow tutorial Don't mind my skin, I am breaking out, it is that time of the month And it has been rocking me But I decided I am tired of feeling blah So I'm up And yeah, here we are doing an eyebrow tutorial Let's get right into it So the first thing you're going to do is brush your eyebrows so i'm brushing them upwards i'm using my spoolie brush to just clean them and prepare them for the next step in this step i'm using my god to be glued um in the yellow package the styling gel i don't know why i did not show it but that's what i'm doing right now the sole reason for doing this is so that my eyebrows are in they stay intact basically and in the shape that I want, well, it's also their natural shape but then they at least they are neat and it's easier to work with them when they like that. And other people actually have bushy eyebrows and it's hard to actually shape them. This helps with that because when they stick in one place, you can shape them as you can see because I don't want mine to be that big. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm trying to clean the upper parts and lay it. I don't know if it makes sense but to just lay it you know yeah that's what i'm trying to do right now and then i'm going to do the same thing on the other side now as the glue dries it has this white residue that i don't like so i'm also trying when you stick them in place you can also just remove that but that is going to be in the next step Now I'm going to use an earbud to clean out all the residue that was left and any product that I do not want on my face or in places that I'm actually going to put the concealer. Now I'm going to be using my pencil to fill in the eyebrows. I'm just doing light strokes starting from the end and then I'm going to move my way to the front. It really just depends on you. like. How you like your eyebrows and just take your time basically just take your time and fill in that's what I'm doing right now sometimes when I don't have time I actually just leave them after the glue part I leave them like that and then I go ahead and consult but for the sake of the video I had to fill in so you can see how I do it so this is what I'm doing right now. Just light strokes, light strokes until you're satisfied with how visible the eyebrows are. I like them dark. I really love them dark because I feel like they look best to me and for me when they're dark. But yeah, so I'm going to do the same thing on the other side and just fill in, fill in, fill in. So as you keep filling in, filling in, your pencil might get blunt. So... I went ahead and sharpened mine because I was going to go in the front side and if you if your pencil is not sharp the strokes are going to be thick like your lines are going to be super thick so I think it's best when you sharpen it so now I'm brushing the eyebrows so that it looks seamless and it blends together the lines are not so harsh I use a flat brush to conceal my eyebrows and these are the two concealers that I use, Chestnut and Fawn. Fawn is the lighter shade that I use at the back or the curve of my eyebrow and then Chestnut is what I use um, by the front and the tail by the end. So yeah, I'm going in with Fawn right now. This is the lighter shade that I'm using right now and then I'm just going to blend this part out there by the tail and the front i'm going to be using chestnut the darker shade which is closest to my skin tone so i'm just gonna blend everything right now this is me blending 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 and then i'm gonna go in with chestnut as you can see with my brush i'm actually tapping on the product and not going straight in because i want the product to rub on the brush and it's easier for me to use like that and i do not make everything dirty so yeah as you can see because i was tapping on the product it's easier for me to make the lines because the concealer is not bulked up like on the brush so i can use it sideways and smooth everything out
going in on the same concealer that I used on the front side and the tail for the upper part of my eyebrow. This is a concealer that is closest to my skin tone. As you can see, you can't even tell. I don't know if you can tell, but there's hair that went out. So I'm trying to fix that like from the side lay that I did with the gel. So it went out and I did not like that because I want the shape to be as small as possible. So this is me trying to fix it. And then I realized I can still see it. And that was a problem for me. I went in with my pencil and I'm trying to fill in. Yeah, Ooh, now that looks better. So I was happy with that and then I let it go. So I always keep pressing on the brush after I use it for some time so that it stays flat flat because when I use it I want it to be flat flat. That's how I actually conceal my eyebrows. That is the easiest way for me to actually conceal when the brush is flat flat. The same rules apply on the other side as well. It's the lighter shade by the corner and then the tail and the front, it's the darkest shade. So I just blend, 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 but I did the same thing as you can see right now. This is the lighter part and then it's darker by the front and it's gonna be darker by the tail as well when I do that. And then I just blend with my sponge. This is me doing the tail and you are. What you do on the left you do on the right and i hope this is clear after all of that i go back to my upper part of the eyebrow and i console with the shade chestnut closest to my skin tone again and then this is me fixing i think i saw something that i did not like so i was fixing that and then you just go you make your curve and yeah so by the front, I'm using a leftover concealer on the brush because I'm still going to brush over it when I'm trying to make it look smooth. Yeah, this is me brushing over the concealer so that the harsh lines are not by the front because you don't want your front to have the lines that are saying, yep, concealed over here. Yeah, so you don't want that. That's what I'm doing right now. I'm brushing over my eyebrows after I've concealed. You also have an option that if you feel like they're too dark, you can... Um, Put on what's this your translucent powder or setting powder and they will look mwah, perfect so this is me done i hope you enjoyed this tutorial and i hope you like it and it was simple and helpful do like comment and share and subscribe thank you so much see you on the next one